this week on Ropes and Design. Oh my God, that's not supposed to be on that, that order. That is so funny. Ha. Huh. I'm Rebecca Robeson, interior designer, businesswoman, and mother. Join me as I take you through my projects, my life, and what keeps me driven to design. Here we go. Desert Rose install, day three. Today we're gonna get started with our shower curtain rods. I have absolutely no strength, it appears. We're installing two rods in each bathroom. One is for the shower curtain, the pretty one, and the other one is for the shower liner. Well, I have to drill a hole before I need to put one curtain up. Because it'll be too close to the drill, you know what I'm saying? No, but I'll trust you. He seems like a practical and experienced enough kind of guy. I actually usually try to place my curtain so that I'm not sliding over that bump. That's not going to slide time. ever. It's just for looks. What do you mean? This is, these are not workable. They're not meant to be opened and closed. Oh, these curtains? Uh-huh. Oh, wow. So they just the have liner, to move it out of the way? The liner goes back and forth. So no, you can't just... slide both of them over to the corner if you want? Why would you want to? To take a bath. A bath? You're killing me. You like tent yourself when you take a bath? And number no, two, why are you taking a bath? I open it up. That's just, okay so Ryan, I'm knowing a little bit too much about you. <laughs> so let's get some shower curtains hung. Are you serious? Yeah. Dead serious. It doesn't, yeah, you're messing with me. <laughs> so yeah, I'm not, but I don't know what the deal is. I just cannot convince this guy that these curtains are gonna be fixed. I'm just gonna let him believe what he needs to, and we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. See, probably what I'm gonna end up doing then is taking the curtain off and measuring the actual curtain, and then measuring the distance from where the, that from sounds, the ring up here sits. That sounds very scientific. Yeah, I think you should do that. That's kind of how you have to do You can't just hold it up here and go, all right, it goes right there. <laughs> Well, I've done that for years, Ryan. I don't know what's the problem. Yeah, I thought they were going to be not quite all the way up. I know, but I really because like, you've never worked with I me really before. I really like them going all the way Of course the way. you do, because they're fabulous. They look nice. He's seen the light. You know what you're doing. I'm leaving. Call me when you get that up. I'll come and look at it. Now, to see what the rest of the team is up to. These are dust Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah, oh, those are so cool. Have you seen these? They're like leather. They're so cute. Look at this, quilted leather. It's like Chanel goes, goes Western. Anyone notice a change in the weather? <laughs> Just a bit. I'm taking this inside. Oh my gosh, who can see? Don't these chairs look sharp? There's a harmony here between masculine and feminine, kind of lodge and luxury all at the same time. Ugh, amazing. All right, now I need to go find the electrician while these guys are doing this. Hi. I need a new best friend, and no one but the electrician is going to do. We may need an unfriendly amount of changes. So this hallway definitely needs to be able to dim. Okay. So if we could just put a little pan right there. Yes. Yeah? Yes. Okay. Oh my God, that's not supposed to be on that, that order. What the heck is this thing? What it is is it's a driftwood lamp. Wait, it's starting to come back to me. Remember how we were trying to get new lamps to go on oh. either side here? And these were nice and big and substantial. So it was something that I asked her to get me a price on she must have thought it was part of the order. Unless this, you know, this might actually be. What is this thing? <laughs> Sorry. Let's see if we can do something with it. Well, it fits. Not there. But I will put it somewhere really cool. That is beautiful. I love things in odd numbers and groups of three. How cool is that? Fabulous. Oh yeah, we need those. Let's check in on Ryan and see where he's at with those shower curtains. 
extra long liner. When you're going up to the ceiling, you can't just get a standard liner for a shower curtain. It has to be uber long. Just tell me the height wise though, is that good? Yeah. If it's even one thirty second off, I'm gonna make you redo it. Are you serious? No. <laughs> yes. It's really close. And I'm worried about Don't over, worry. Over time. Don't worry. What if it starts to go. Don't worry. Okay, so probably put that in as close as you can where it's still gonna be functional. We finalized all our replacements and now Ryan can get to knocking it out. Perfect. Yep. Thank you. Actually, I wanna put this one. No, in. no, no, tier, no. Mm -mm. no. 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 You'll see a tear, exactly but it, it'll be from my way. eye. All right, how are we doing? So here's what I was thinking. So I'm thinking this color on this part of the star. I just want Grayson to use his faux finishing techniques to kind of give me that antiqued look with some gold in it. Do you want any copper or any bronze, I mean? Well, I think that the gold, when it's you wipe other. away the into the black, it turns bronze. So if I put bronze on black and then put gold on the bronze, then I think it looks like this. You want to do a test? Sure. I just don't want you to take all day, and it oh, will take all day. I thought I was going to get all day to do this. No. There's no doubt that he's going to make this beautiful and exactly what I'm looking for, but at what cost of time? Will you get going on this, and I will come back Sounds and good. see. How's that? Sounds good. And then if you would like to stop and eat lunch. Someday. Don't. Time to make a decision on our baseboard stain. The carpentry crew is pretty unique in that it's a father and his young sons. Seems like a really cool family bonding experience to me. Not that my kids would do it, but it seems to work for them. I love this. This is like really fun. Crazy man. So our first choice is this medium walnut color. Or the second option is a deep cherry color. Which do you like? Leave me a comment below and let me know which one would you have picked. You know what is kind of interesting about that? Is it be sort of in the middle. But you know what, I think this is consistent, like I was saying. This is our winner. One catastrophe that we didn't have to deal with. I mean, it was aborted. Averted? What's the word? Averted! Aborted. How embarrassing. My eyes are so like, uh, huh? Uh-huh. Are you? you Good, I can't shots? wait. You yeah, I'm going to take some shots. You ready to bring one over? No, not yet. Come on. Please. You should be done by now. Yeah. Well, hurry up, because you got a bunch of nightstands to take care of. How many? A lot. take a closer look at our inventory. This is a C room and it's a Milano bed. Cars and dressers don't and come until the first week of July. As I mentioned before, and it's pretty obvious, the end will not be completed by the time we leave. So no dresser, huh? But we are gonna get these rooms as close as possible to being guest ready. This has the full size mattress, uh, box springs, and a mattress, and look how short it makes the headboard. Not to mention the nightstands. You'd fall out of bed trying to reach an alarm that low. Might get you up earlier, but not happier. So I need to go through and identify each room that has the wrong mattress box spring combination, and then they need to be fixed. This one is a huge problem. Wait till you see this. Big old box springs. Makes a little tiny headboard. I'm sorry, this is ridiculous. So that's for the room? Yeah. Okay, and then where would the roller shades be, or whatever it was we got? I don't Honeycombs or something. I don't know. Ah! Oh my god. Thought you shot me. Huh? About to. <laughs> How's this going? Good. Ooh. You did it fast. He did a great job, and he did it quick. Just this part needs to be like that. Cool. That <clears throat> looks good. Ooh. 
Luis took my design concept for the entrance to the lobby and he made a hand forged 13 foot tall gate. These gates are gonna add structure and elegance to the entrance, contributing enormously to what I hope will be the lobby's striking first impression. You done? Wow. Whoa. That's beautiful. Close them up partially, like enough for the light fixture to be in the picture. I cannot wait to show this to Amr. Oh, oh honey, man. this is honey. lovely. Oh. They really planned for oh, us, didn't they? I wonder who had they? working on this thing. I oh, don't know, but if it looks this, this good on the awesome. outside. We should hire whoever did this work. We should. Do you think her card is oh. sitting on, oh, maybe your card? You know, there's probably a big His... picture with a cutout. <laughs> She's running That's a around. great idea. Nice. Look at this, oh. first impression. Oh, okay, all right, Oh, Mr. Electrician. It appears that the designer on the project made one slight mistake 16 times. Well, not a mistake. More of an oversight, really. Well, apparently, when you close the shower curtain, it's really dark in there. We didn't put a light in the tub. I've never put a light in a tub before. I put them in showers, but not tubs. But the shower curtain is Sick. I'm bringing in the electrician. Would you please? I would love to. Just pretend you're taking a shower. Okay. And you gotta shave your legs. And you gotta shave your legs. It's dark. And not in a romantic way. Just dark. So I would like to be on a plane on Wednesday on my way home when you bring this up to Amr. Oh, no. We're gonna Perfect. talk about it right now. Oh, no! Yeah, okay, you better talk right now. now. All right, people, it's time to hang some art. Can you help? Do. Look how beautiful that blue looks. It's so pretty. The light's perfect on that one there. Out of the kitchen. You ever wonder how they get hotel art to stay put? You drill your hole, hammer in your anchor, then your screws screw in your T-screw, lock it down, and your art is secure. Got it. It's the first time I've ever used one of these. It works. We have an issue. The window treatments. They're too big. They're too big. My window treatments are actually going into the door casements. I forgot about the casement. Which means this whole thing has to move over, which means that window treatment goes right over to the edge of the door. So what are we gonna do about it? It's not like at home, where we can just send it back to the drapery workroom. We gotta do it here. This can come undone. If we can cut this, and then just wrap this back around, it'll just go back in there and no one will ever know. I know you're an iron guy. <laughs> But um, could you start to specialize in fabric? Let's hope for a steep learning curve. How many? 16. They're not even. I know. They're distanced differently. It's because the board that had the right, the right, the correct board, which was the shorter one on this side, that was evenly spaced. And then this one had much wider spaces because it had the same amount of fabric, but a wider board distance to go. So she had to kind of... Well, now that we've... So that's the other thing is, these all need to be redone and spaced out so that they look the same as that. That's what I said all along is, the spacing has to be the same. You can't do that. Why? Too late. What? Too late? Okay, I can understand Scott's survival instinct, and just knowing what we have to do to get this place ready in time, that alone is gonna take a miracle, but I can see into the future, and if we don't do something about this, it's gonna look terrible, I'm sorry. I'm gonna do whatever it takes. What, you thought that was it? 
the day is far from over, and by the time we're done with it, it'll be much closer to sunrise than it would be to sunset. Are you undoing the staples? Yes, I do. Didn't they do these when they sent them over? They did, but they weren't done correctly. They didn't match the other side, and so the spacing in between. So you guys are completely redoing them by hand? Yep. 16 of them. You guys are champs. Yes, we are. Subscribe. Pull that back just a little bit. Okay. Right? Ready? Turn. Oh my God, look at how beautiful this thing is. Do you know what it says? Louise, Welcome. you are a ah! miracle worker. Oh, the dust. Oh, not the dust, it's the beauty of this thing. It's blinding you, darling.